Hey everybody, it's 32322 here. I'm very depressed today. You see, I've probably got three, four, maybe even five people who watch my YouTube videos. I'm holding back tears right now. Okay. Now, just, just one person to go to this page and donate, which is the best, okay? Or if you know my Aunt Taryn, go say hi to her. Go tell her you love her. Stuff like that. Guys, my grandpa died. Not this year, when I was like six, seven, or eight, or nine. Okay, and that was probably the hardest thing to go through. Okay. Oh my gosh. Now, I know you're thinking, dude, it's your grandpa, why do we really care? Well guys, if you had a family member, like your mom or your dad, and they had, they, they were saying, Oh my gosh, I, I could die any single second. What would you do? Would you set up a donation page? Would you go to the hospital? What, what would you do? Comment below on what you would do. Okay. But at this point, I really don't care about comments. Or subs. Or views. Or likes. Okay, I just do not want my aunt Tara to die, okay? Seriously. As I said, my grandpa <sighs> Gosh. My grandpa died and I really don't want that to happen again, guys. I am not kidding. That was the hardest experience. It was so young that... You guys... <laughs> now I understand what death actually means, alright? I seriously do not want my aunt Taryn to die. I don't want to see her in a casket. I don't want to see any of my family members in a casket. Okay. It was so hard seeing my grandpa. When I was about that young, I... I don't know what I did, guys. I just, like, looked at it, and I thought he was sleeping. That's what I seriously thought. But now I still have that image stuck in my head, guys. It's stuck right in my head. And I don't know how to get it out. But there's no way I'm going to get it out. Because why would I want to get a picture of my grandpa out of my dang head? One day in Thanksgiving... This lady came up to my mom. She said I could talk to my grandpa. And after that, we went home. My mom talked to me about it, and... Yeah. Yeah, I was pretty surprised. But I've been trying for three years now. Alright, and if, Grandpa, if you're near me anywhere right now, okay? I, I love you, okay? I love you. And Grandpa, if you, if, Grandma, Grandpa, I don't know anybody if you're watching this right now, I love you. Alright. I'm not standing my family members, not all you people watching. Oh my gosh. Guys, I, I just can't go through this again. Guys, I'm, I'm only like 11 years old, man. I can't see another person die, okay? Yeah, I don't want to, man. Yeah, I just, I, I won't be able to stand it. I'll, I'll, I'll stay in the bathroom the whole time. <laughs> I'm not even kidding, guys.
can't do it. <sighs> okay, well, this video isn't supposed to be, um, about just about me and Darren. I'm going to be talking about something that I've been wanting to figure out for the past couple of days. So, what I've been trying to figure out, guys, is what store is more um, responsible. <laughs> so, you go to Walmart, you build a toilet paper for it, and if they get mad at you, what do you do? Do you do it again or do you stop? Put that in the comments below. I would probably do it again if they got mad. No, I'm just kidding. Just because karma would come back to me, alright? But if Walmart says, yeah, that's funny, dude, just... Just if somebody sees you and they get worried about it, then... You know, just don't do it again. Then I wouldn't do it again. But I would do it at a different store. That's what I'm trying to tell, okay? Which store is more responsible with customers? You go to Costco, you build a toilet paper for it. If, if they come up to it, they bash it down and they grab you and they kick you out. Like, seriously, just kick you out. That's called, like, very, very, very not responsible with their people. They punch through the wall, they tell you to get out. Then... Yeah, I guess that's, yeah, not okay. They come inside and say, hey, can you guys please get out of here? Yeah, that's actually pretty fun. If they look at you inside of there, between the crack or something, or like pull out a toilet paper roll or something, say, hey guys, you guys can stay in here unless you... I don't want to leave, but you guys got to stop making noise, all right? Because people are getting really weird about what's going on in there. Well, that's called perfect. All right, now I'm probably going to do it to Walmart, Costco, Meyer, and I don't know where else. Some other store. Probably specifically Walmart, Meyer, and Costco. Like if you want me to go to Walmart and dislike if you want me to go to Meyer. Alright. See you guys later. 322-322 here. Link is in this video right here. It has one view. Um, thank you guys for all of these views. My, my most viewed video is prison scrap mechanic gameplay where it's just me talking to a dang black screen. Not in a racist way, but it's seriously a black screen. Um. As you see, watch time is going up. And I'm not earning any money, guys. Subscribers going up. Dislikes going up, likes going up, comments going down. Uh, let's see, who watched this? How do I see who watched this? while blowing up my channel. So these are all my videos, alright? You're going to see videos like right over here, more about vlogs. Because guess what? You guys all hate gameplay, okay? I know. I know. Okay. So gonna start making vlogs, alright?
Dang it. Now I have to give a shout out to all these people. Shout out to Paul Soros Jr. Shout out to Phase Rain. Shout out to Viceland. I subscribed to Viceland because of King of the Road. <clears throat> I don't know why I'm still subscribed to them, but shout out to Viceland. Shout out to Jay, Just a Studio. Shout out to Thresh, Thresh, Thresher Magazine. Same thing, King of the Road. Shout out to Zombie Go Boom. Shout out to Nugger. Nugget Noggin, shout out to, yeah, shout out to my pet, shout out to SDX Entertainment, shout out to Little Big Shots, and Jack Septic Guy, shout out to Jack Septic Guy. Um, Little Big Shots, you guys should really watch. It's a really good show. Also, my cat is in solitary until he stops peeing. So, yeah. See you guys later. 3 2 3 2 Signing out. Peace.